men sleep. Do you know why? I'm going to say it. Obviously, we are speaking to uh, a lot of students as well. Because they cannot marry the person they want. So now they are depressed. It's over. The story, the whole globe and one and a half billion women, they all mean nothing. No, close them. Why? I'm depressed. Why? One person, I didn't manage. But that person is one. There might be 100 people who want to marry that person. Say, for example, if there is a girl, Alhamdulillah, let's hope it's based on goodness, not just on looks, my beloved brothers and the sisters as well. You want to marry someone? Don't base it just on looks. Remember, you want happiness. It's very important to decide, make the important decision of marriage based on the of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. That is how you get peace. So I'm not saying you do not look at what they look like. You look at it, but make sure the deen is in order. The character is in order. Those two are the main most important things to look at. Today, immediately people look at what car you're driving, what salary you are getting, what house you are living in and so on. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala warns us in the Quran. Warns us. Something amazing. Where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us to get married to the women. And if there is poverty in the equation, marriage itself will bring about sustenance. If they are poor, it is through that marriage. Allah will grant them sustenance through his virtue. The virtue belongs to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So the point I was raising is 100 people want to marry the same person. How many are going to marry that person? One. Say it's a girl. 100 boys are vying for the post. I want to marry this girl. Wow. One is going to manage the other 99. Should they be depressed? Let's be honest. Should they be in bed the whole day? I don't want to get up. Why? Because my son has already said, come on, man. We all now are depressed. How can you allow yourself to become depressed because of the decree of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? You tried your best. Yes. What was the result? They refused or it was not possible for some reason. Well, now move on. Life is short. One youngster came to me. It reminds me now. He told me, but will I get her in Jannah? What am I going to say? If I say no problem, he can't sleep again. If I say yes, it's another problem because she's the wife of someone else now. People are making dua to be together in Jannah with someone else's wife. What peace do you want my brother?